the paradigms, the precepts that we hold dear, that we even sub uh, routines that uh, paradigm is like a way that we, uh, it's a belief in our mind that we live by, that we created this thing to help us understand the world we live in, right? like a paradigm. I, after I did just a video, my first video on YouTube, I it, it moved to seemingly a different uh, part of the country that uh, they're uh, making. They're on a grill and uh, they're cleaning, uh, making food, right? Outdoors and. It's an art, right? It's an art, but first thing, uh, uh, first uh, reaction could be, oh, well, are they Muslim? Uh, or um, I love hamburgers and french fries. I'm American. I, I uh, have, I'm really picky in food. Uh, you know, other nations, dietary, um, they, what they live by in the diet. Uh, I see a lot of times that the poor overseas even eat bugs. Um, it's a taboo in America not to eat a bug. Uh, but uh, as the first, uh, uh, the first uh, of paradigms that come to mind is foreign food, uh, foreign people. I don't even get along with Americans for the most part. Not, uh, well, I mean, in a many, in a context, a certain context, I don't want to curse myself as to that being the absolute fact. But I, um, but then the second one is, oh, you know, this livelihood, you know, he's um, good in his craft. He's clinging and and uh, uh, making it a show for people that that see him cooking uh, these these. Uh, Arabics or Indian people or what have you, whatever nation they're from. But then I smile, right? It's like, oh yeah, you know, you're putting on a, you're you're a good worker. You're putting your heart into your craft. That you are you know, trying to entertain me. And I smile. Oh, you're beautiful, you know. And then, then I walk away, and I'm thinking, okay, what does that do to people? So then, you know, I had another uh, lens that this person is prideful in his job. We all, who hasn't been prideful and excelling at uh, what uh, they do? So what would by what would be the right lens to go by? Right. Uh, first of all, I'm offended. I don't. I eat hamburgers and French fries. I don't want to eat bugs. I don't. I'm not saying that there, that there was bugs that he was cooking, but it's uh, a paradigm in my mind. That makes me think, oh, you, you know, just going up to a vendor in another country, you don't know what you're going to eat. So now nah, I'm just going to find a McDonald's or something. Hopefully I'm not in India. <laughs> then another thing is um, learn culture. It's uh, America. Um, the world is so rich in culture that just because uh, other people have different ways of living, other ways of eating, other ways of doing things. I watched The Glory of Love, one of my favorite uh, video songs. and I, I see the ceremonial, uh, I don't know if she's Japanese or whatever in the show, that how they move the cup, you know, 180 degrees or how they do things, it's a ritual. But the thing is, is that... Um, you can learn other cultures and appreciate like, oh, what do you guys do that for? What do you, uh, what's the ceremony about with the whole, you know, the ladle and, you know, and, and turning the cup, I don't get it. it. Turn it, you know, you drink from it, you turn it 180 degrees or something, you give it to me. And what is that all about? What is the, not to, not to be, oh, no, I'm not interested. I, I'm all into the Duke. Cowboys and Indians, but uh, uh, to appreciate the differences that we cultures and races have. And, uh, but uh, what lens is the correct one? I think it depends. I think it depends on, um, I think it depends on uh, the spirit of 
the person you approach, you know, it, are, are they um, not, uh, are they not taking their job seriously? If I go to a vendor, I can have all kinds of reactions. Is it the vendor just went to the bathroom and doesn't care about his job or the employees and he didn't wash his hands, he didn't clean up, he just went back to cooking, tired of his job. So I'd be, oh, no, I have that kind of reaction. Or should I see a guy that's doing a show and he's doing it because he loves people and he wants people to be happy to have smiles? And I sense that from him. And hey, how you doing, man? Tell me about yourself. You're pretty good at um, your job. This is really cool. How long have you been doing it? Or should I go in there and yeah, yeah pride is a hard one to be. To, you get prideful on top of that mountain in your job. Try to 